Ti verrà al meglio. Allora si sta. Cucina. Cucina? Che fa? Eh, eh, non so la fa lui. E beh, 5 minuti prima non vuoi dire Lo sì, sai, no, per quanto sta a tavolo sul piano. Ammassa tutto quanto che ha mangiato. E eh, beh, io si indossa sempre allo scopo la piscina. Che adesso, sì, fammi avere, fa. Fa, come sta bene, no? E beh, uh, nasce la vita, si gioca, si porta una piscina, ma si va e che buono, a me, nasce la vita, che buono dei soldi, non vengono niente. Ma già prima su me niente è così, no. eh? Ma non si va a venire? No. Ma tu vedi a tuo figlio, sì? Ma se andate le mani anzi le vie. Ma ce le buttiamo a mosso cosa? Eh? Eh va va, però torno subito a messo perché sanno fatto qui questi manzoni. Ya, mo! So we started to hang out at the Baha'i Center to just chat, study together and consult. Or at least we would try. Children were everywhere playing, shouting, screaming. We didn't know quite what to do with all these children hanging around the center. Some came up with a very interesting suggestions. But finally, we started visualizing the perfect solution. Let's start a summer educational program for the children here in Portici. Everyone started getting really excited about the idea and immediately we all started to work on it. Our local resources definitely wouldn't have been enough, so we started to call various friends from various corners of Italy to come and help. Since 1992, our project has been going on with enormous success and we have decided to name it the Nazrin Educational Center in honor of one of our dear Baha'i friends, which worked and served with us. Allora, io posso cantare la stessa canzone, la posso cantare. Siamo il fiore di un giardino, oppure posso cantare. Siamo i fiori di un giardino. Oppure, quello che fanno tante volte tutti è Siamo i fiori... Fatti urlare. Noi siamo tutti frutti della stessa terra. The Nazarene Educational Center is a two-week program which has a very defined structure and method. Last year the children had built the perfect city and this year the program is structured around the qualities which the citizens need to develop in order to live in this perfect city. Each day the children discuss different themes, kindness, cleanliness, humility, service, and through different social and artistic activities they confront these issues. Through the different artistic expressions the children express creatively their views and ideas. Through games, videos and stories from all around the world, the principle of the day is continuously emphasized. The day begins with a reading, prayers and holy writings, followed by consultation on the themes of the day. Una consultazione dove gli educatori e i bambini parlano e dove ascoltano tutti e parlano tutti su questo, su questo metodo, con questo metodo in cui 
effetti i bambini si esprimono quindi cade il fatto del concetto di inculcare certe cose ai bambini ma si eleva un altro concetto che è quello di tirare fuori dai bambini quindi i bambini si esprimono gli operatori conoscono quello che, che sanno i bambini che hanno i bambini quello che possono ancora dare e quindi c'è un, un risultato diverso più spontaneo, più sincero migliore sicuramente The project assumes an even stronger impact when placed in our local reality. Portici, one of the suburban villages around Naples, is situated between the sea, which is most of the time polluted and dirty, and the Vesuvio Vulcano, which makes the area very susceptible to dangerous seismic activities. The people live their lives with simplicity, day by day. The local Partenopean tradition is very felt and Catholicism is very rooted in the culture. One of the largest problems which afflicts our area is unemployment and the strong economic disadvantages. Partially for this reason and partially for tradition, people live in a large families cramped in a small houses. <laughs> They say that Portici is the second most dense area in the world, after Hong Kong. People live compact, with no specific rules, traffic, confusion are normal part of the day. The heat and the sun demand a very high rhythm of life. Unfortunately, these localities register a very high crime rate. Corruption, drugs, burglary, fraud, illegal trade, organized crime are all daily activities. The children who come to Nazarene Educational Center have grown up in the rogue streets and among the parents screaming at home. 